Hello, YouTube. I'm here to make a quick update. Um, should have picked the berries out of my teeth first. FYI, if you're making blueberry smoothies, probably not the best idea to take them to go because you will have blueberries in your teeth, all over your teeth for whoever you decide to chat with. It's not very attractive. I got it out. Anyway, I wanted to update you. I just got back from the grocery store. It's Wednesday. This is our day. I'm looking at my daughter who's over here finishing her lunch. Um, Wednesdays are our day to go out and run errands. My son goes to the little gym and has gymnastics class. And then afterwards, I always go to the grocery store and grab my proteins for the week. And um, now I'm adding into my regime. Um, I started doing smoothies and juices, uh, which is going to work well into my six day happy pouch plan because I do two days of liquids. Um, and I'm also starting to replace a breakfast or a lunch with a shake or a smoothie or a juice um, for the rest of the week as well. So I actually really like it. I got a new toy that I wanted to show you. And I'm going to turn the camera around here. I did a haul today at the grocery store, which was ridiculous. Like, who goes to the grocery store and spends $40 on, like, twigs and berries and, um, like ginger root, like actual ginger root. I don't think I've ever bought one of these in my life. I have like the little dried bottle of ginger, but I have legit ginger. Um, I got all kinds of stuff I've never bought before, but like I said, yeah, this kind of way of eating is really expensive. Um, but I wanted to say that I think it's gonna be totally worth it because I literally just fed my daughter lunch and I made a um, a drink, a power drink from my new ninja cookbook because I got a ninja, and we had we had the Powerball smoothie, and I don't know if you can read that or not. It's a pretty simple one to make, but I added a handful of kale and a teaspoon of flax to this. A recipe because why not right you might as well just throw more nutrition in there if you can there was room so that's what we had and I poured a little bit of mine into her vanilla yogurt and mixed it up with a little bit of rice cereal and hello she had a lunch packed full of antioxidants and amazing stuff and I think this is gonna be really good for her and really good for me and I've noticed that when you're drinking things like this being really loud sorry it definitely gives your body this crazy energy boost like I've never ever noticed it when I ate regular food um, I drank one of these power drinks or smoothies oh I also added a scoop of my designer way vanilla protein to that as well because I wanted extra protein since I'm using it as a meal replacement um, when you drink this kind of stuff it totally fuels your body like in a way that a sandwich doesn't do it, or I don't know, anything. So it's like pure energy going straight into your bloodstream, which I like. Um, I have not lost any more weight on the scale, although people are telling me that I'm looking leaner, and I kind of honestly feel like leaner in my face somehow, so I don't know what the deal is with that, but I've on, I've, I'm kind of switching... I'm doing this for my health, at least the whole juicing and the smoothie thing. Like, I just want to feel really good and feel like I'm in optimum health and vitality. And I know I've got some hormone, weird hormone imbalances going on since I had Shiloh, which is a whole other story, and we'll have to talk about that at a different time. So I've been researching different berries and things. It's a blabbermouth. Um, berries and things that will help medicinally balance out hormones and uh, just help me feel better and just get me back to normal. Um, yeah, she did a number on me and I don't know if it's just that she's the third baby. I don't know, but something changed chemically for me and yeah, I just feel off. And so I don't know if it also has to do is, is causing me my weight loss issues and not able to get the weight off. I don't know, but I'm starting there. I'm going with all these fresh berries and fruits and reading up on what they do for you. She is loud. My gosh, of course, the second I start making a video, she wants to chat. 
I know. You're talkative today. Um, so let me show you what I bought at the store. A lot of it still is in the freezer. Hopefully you can see this because I put most of it away. Um, make sure I'm aiming this correctly. Okay. Let me, you know what? Let's just do it this way. I'll just hold things up because I can't tell where the camera's pointing. Okay, so goji berries. These were kind of spendy. This little tiny bag of dried goji berries was like seven bucks. And uh, it's only like four ounces of berries. Um, what I'm gonna do is soak these in water to plump them back up and then throw them into my smoothies. Goji berries, this is one of the items that's gonna help with my hormones. Um, it's anti-aging, lots of antioxidants. Along with raspberries, it's gonna really help. Um, so yeah, so these are more medicine than anything else. Um, I've got like kiwis to go in some of the green smoothies. I already showed you the weird ginger. I got a couple of those. I have like actual oranges. I have not bought like large navel oranges in forever. My family just doesn't really eat these, but there's a couple recipes that call for those. So I got a couple of those. Um, we have honey to sweeten things with, which I don't typically buy. Got a big old bag of flax seeds, um, which I can throw in there. I love that the ninja can grind this up. So I don't have to buy the already grinded up kind. And also something about flax seeds that I didn't know, store these in your freezer. If you get whole flax seeds, they will go rancid in a matter of just a couple weeks, unless you keep them in the freezer and they will last for months and months. So didn't know that. Um, that's all I have out here on my counter. I have a giant, huge bag of blueberries for their antioxidants. Um, there's a lot of recipes that have blueberries in them, breakfast shakes. I will mix them, like the one I just had had a banana and blueberries in it and I put my protein powder. It's a good breakfast one, so I'm gonna be doing those for breakfast a lot. Um, I do tons of blueberry stuff. These, this is a product that one of my friends sells that I absolutely love, 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 love these. And they're kind of expensive too, I wanna say. It's like $33 for this package that lasts you a month. Um, but, it's insane how much is in these um, antioxidant wise and it just does something magical and makes you feel really, really good. And my husband swears that it curbs his appetite. He has high blood pressure um, typically and these help stabilize his blood pressure. Um, you're supposed to um, have two of these as a snack in between your meals daily, which is the dosage. I usually just do one because I'm having all this other stuff, all these other blueberries and things. So, I think that's all I got. Oh, I did get celery to add to some shakes, to some juices and things. But anyway, I just want to make a quick update to tell you. I'm sorry, baby. She's getting really mad um, that I did. I got this bad boy right here that I'm super excited about. And I love, okay, so it comes with, it's all the way across the kitchen. Comes with, can you see that? The big blender thing, which is awesome because on the weekends I will do shakes for the whole family or juices for the whole family. But it also came with three of these single serve ones that you just snap the blade onto. And so like I can have these in the dishwasher. That was my issue before is that when you get the ones that only have one cup, it's always dirty. It's never ready to use when you want to. You gotta pull a thing out of the dishwasher and hand wash it, which is a pain in the butt. And you're just not gonna drink shakes if it's that hard. So I love this because it came with three of these. So if my son wants one, and he uses it and it's in the dishwasher, I still have two more. So I don't have to yell at him for using my single serve cups. Anyway, I love the Ninja. So that's it, that's my update. And um, I'll let you know how it goes. I have a feeling that doing all of this natural foods and shakes and antioxidants and getting my hormones back under control that the weight's gonna start falling off. I just have that feeling because my body is like digging it right now. It loves it. And I've only been doing it for a couple days. So, all right. Gotta go. Talk to you guys later. She's getting a tooth. She's getting really crabby. So, I will talk to you guys later. And I hope you're making healthy choices.